So that first Easter was filled with fear, but Jesus came and gave peace. Now, in the time that followed, Jesus appeared to his disciples a number of times. And John chapter 21 gives us one of those times Jesus appeared. It begins like this. Afterward, Jesus appeared again to his disciples by the Sea of Tiberias. It happened this way. Simon Peter, Thomas, called Didymus, Nathaniel from Cana and Galilee, the sons of Zebedee, and two other disciples were together. I'm going out to fish, Simon Peter told them. And they said, yeah, we'll go with you. So they went out, got into the boat, but that night they caught nothing. So the disciples, many of whom had been fishermen, are waiting around for Jesus. And Simon says, well, I'm going to go fish. And a bunch of the guys say, yeah, we'll go with you. Now, I've heard some people say that this was an act of disbelief, that the disciples said, well, Jesus is back, but now he's gone again, so we're just going to go back to what we used to do. I disagree with that. The disciples were waiting for Jesus, and while they were waiting for Jesus, they wanted to do something useful. And they said, well, we can fish. We can provide food for other people by using the gifts God has given us. We know how to fish, so we're going to fish. In other words, they're a lot like you. See, right now, we're waiting for Jesus to come back. And right now, Jesus doesn't want you to just sit around going, hey, is he back yet? Nope. I guess I'll just keep on waiting. Now, in the meantime, Jesus wants you to use your gifts for the benefit of the people around you. Sometimes we call that vocation. That, that you have been given certain gifts. Uh, for instance, you have a job. And God wants you to use that job to bless others. You have other roles in your life. Perhaps you are a child of someone else. You are a friend. You are a spouse. You are a parent. All of these different roles have different responsibilities and different ways for you to bless the people around you. So while we're waiting for Jesus, let's use those vocations to serve.